Hey, welcome back everybody. Sign here again with a uh, just a little quick video about uh, how I set up my immersive taming uh, settings and whatnot. So one of the first things is I have my uh, my base game immersive or uh, my base game taming stat at uh, six times, which was a holdover from previous you know playthroughs stuff like that. I just never changed it, and gotta wait for this journal to load up. Now I've got a lot of mods adding creatures and whatnot, so it it has to go through read all those creatures, right? And you can see here, you know, tank speed multiplier 0.25, hand feed efficiency. Most of these stats have not been changed. Uh, the 0.25 I changed myself, which we'll go over here in just a second. And uh, let's see, max imprint 25%, huh? I have no idea what half of this stuff is. I did change the uh, HUD notification duration to 6 seconds, 6.0. And I turned on enable baits from flyers and enable baits from non-weaponry dinos. So, and I think I turned on redistribute wasted stats. So, all right. Um, most of that, I think everything else is, oh, I tame effect and this is off. Whoops. I thought that, I think that's off by default actually though. All right, so to change all this stuff. Now, apparently, according to a lot of things, there's a, uh, that's my journal. Here we go. There's a, a some sort of radial menu you get with this, which I have uh, I have never seen. But there's also the command you can enter in, and it is the script command, one word, space, IT, settings. And that'll bring up this wonderful window right here. Take a second to load in, because again, a lot of dinosaurs. It's a lot quicker if you're doing this on a straight vanilla run. Well, as vanilla as you can get with mods. But because all these dinos uh, spawn on the map I'm on currently, all these aberrants and so on and so forth, um, there's even some X variants and whatnot available. Uh, yeah, it's got to load all those in. But what we're looking at here is stats have changed, immersive taming speed multiplier. I changed to 0 0.25. And then I left the rest of these stats here alone. Immersive taming only, I turned on. Uh, enable protection initiates tame is on by default. Taming XP, dino gifts, this is mostly on by default at this point. Uh, enable taming ineffectiveness, I do not have activated. I probably should have though. Redistribute wasted stats. Whenever you get the bonus levels on a dino from taming, uh, any points, I think, that go to speed. And oxygen, if it's a creature that doesn't have an oxygen stat, will get redistributed to other stats where they can be useful. You can still end up with getting a bunch of points to food and whatnot, but at least you're not stuck with 20 levels into speed, which is completely useless. Um, let's see. Enable baits from flyers and non-weaponry dinos are turned off by default. I turned those on. Non-weaponry dinos are any dinosaur you cannot pull a weapon out on. And flyers is obviously self-explanatory. This will let you uh, tame from those dinosaurs. Normally you couldn't. Normally you can only tame from dinosaurs <clears throat> that you can pull out a weapon on. Which is actually a bit of a small list when you get down to it. Uh, combat progress bar I think is on by default as well. I turned... Actually I don't think I changed any of the combat stuff when you get down to it. Taming and printing is a thing. You can actually kind of sort of imprint your dinosaur by taming it, which is kind of a cool function. I probably should turn that on by default, honestly. And I'll leave it off for now. Uh, enable HUD notifications, the text you get at the top of your screen whenever, you know, you feed it or whatever. That's that's all that is. Uh, 6.0 is a six second duration, uh, the default. Whenever I was getting like 10 things showing up at once, it was clearing out too quickly for me to see. And then bait affinity overrides, I didn't touch any of this, but here is also a helpful chart to see how helpful different things are. And uh, obviously the higher the number, the better off it is, so on and so forth. And, but I mean, that was pretty much it for everything on my settings that I changed. Really, I didn't tweak a whole lot. And the only reason I turned the uh, taming speed multiplier to 0.25 is because my base taming rate is 6. So this works out to, well... 6 times a quarter is 1.5. And obviously if you have base taming rates, then uh, definitely 
definitely don't do the 0.25 unless you want to be sitting there staring at a dodo for half an hour. Uh, but any questions, leave them in the comments, and uh, hope to see you next episode.